Today we will be doing a sheep directed drawing. There are two examples. One is horizontal and one is vertical. It doesn't matter how you choose to set up your paper. You will need a white piece of paper, a black marker for the outline, and you're going to start with a U shape to make the head and sort of like a little cloud shape to make the top then you're going to add little triangles on either side for the ears and put a little line to show the separation. Next, you're going to do two little black eyeballs. And then to make the nose, you're going to do a little V shape with a line down to the bottom of the face. Here's a cute little face. For his body, you're going to do the same thing you did for the top of the head, just larger. So it's a larger fluffy cloud with a little fluffy tail. If it runs off the side of the paper, that's okay. No big deal. For its legs, you're going to draw one big rectangle and you're going to split it down the middle to show two legs, and then one little line towards the bottom to make the hooves. And this one's going to be kicking out, so we're going to draw one leg by itself with the little hoof, and then one leg sort of kicking out so our sheep looks like it's dancing. The last step before coloring is to add the texture to the sheep's body. So I just sort of like did a swirl shape all along the open fur parts, including the tail and the top of its head, just so it looks like a curly sheep. See how that little detail, you can absolutely see those curls now. And then the last step is just to add some details. So you could put your sheep uh, up on a hill, it could be playing in a field. You could add some pink detailing to the nose and some pink to the ears. Just to bring your little sheep to life. Go ahead and add whatever other details you want and I'm sure your sheep will turn out beautifully. I hope you enjoyed this directed drawing.